Good morning, so today I'm gonna show you a very cheap suggestion of uh, juice which is raw. So here we have uh, blood oranges. It's a one and a half kilo and you can buy it for around uh, one and a half euros. Um, so it's very cheap. You can see some of them are more ripe, some of them are less. For example, this are is really not ripe and these ones are really ripe and this one will be even more because it's, you can already see it's um, quite red on the outside <laughs> <laughs> not really but you can see it's very dark red so let's just take one and you can buy this uh, hand juicer for like uh, two or three euros in uh, any like kitchen appliances shop and it's just juice like this, just twist it. It's a little bit of work, but on the other hand you don't have to peel the oranges, so that's a plus. So like that then that's a bit more okay so like that and here you have the juice okay so let's cut it and see the next part so now we juice some more oranges here and important thing is to Put the pop back in. Many people don't want to do it because I don't know they just don't want to taste that pop. But yeah, you need a fiber there to for a proper release um, or absorption absorption of sugars. So you need it there, and just put all the pulp there, and then just pour it slowly. Yeah. Okay, so that's it. I'm gonna juice some more. So now we juice the, the blood oranges here, and what you want to do next? Um, let's start with this one. So, juice everything, pop there, everything. So, you pour some water there. and you just add your brown sugar that's it now you stir it and that's it, there is your juice very cheap raw lots of vitamins in there hmm? pretty good and the same do if you want more concentrated like this is 100% concentrated so you add half water and then you add sugar so that's 50% concentrated and same with that one so this is a suggestion how you can keep a uh, very healthy on low budget. It's one and a half kilo of oranges, so there must be lots of nutrients. And it's better way than eating them by themselves because they're not sweet at all or not very good quality. And when you add sugar, it's actually eatable. Um, and I also wanted to talk about today. Um, I saw a demon holder on Facebook post it about if it's better to eat avocados or starches for dinner and I made a video about it uh, a while ago where I said I made experiments where I was eating avocados for dinner maybe four or five days consequently and I noticed my sleep was not as good I was waking up too many times I couldn't fall asleep as easily at night and then um, I felt like avocados was still digesting 
I was not actually going to toilet in the, in the morning, but it was digesting until lunch or maybe even after. So the digestion was very slow and energetically uh, I felt fine because I was eating still enough carbohydrates from fruits and fruit juices. But I didn't have that extra energy when I eat cooked carbs and I felt kind of hungry and just uh, looking for those avocados every evening. And also I want to talk about um, when you eat fruits diet, uh, you all, you're always going to crave something uh, salty in the evening. That doesn't matter like how much fruit you're going to eat. And if you eat just salad, you might not get enough carbohydrates in two. So if you eat some cooked starches, I prefer potatoes because they digest the best. Then you're going to have that extra energy. Um, so I don't know anybody that can eat just fruit all day, sweet, sweet, sweet. Um, I think any, every, anybody can relate to me that they need something more salty and people who want to stay raw they eat just avocados and yes I was staying lean because when you eat just avocados it's like volume like this and when you eat cooked carbs that's more volume so it looks like you're going to sleep uh, with a big belly but in the morning it's uh, again slim so it's not the case it's uh, Cook starch is gonna make you fat or something. So just uh, just experiment. If the rice doesn't work for you, as Demon stated, because he gets acne. Uh, I agree. Sometimes if you eat like gluten pasta or something, you can get a sinus or a detox. But uh, cooked starches like potatoes work for me very good. So I agree. 100% raw food diet is the best. So eating primarily fruits and for the evening uh, fruits and vegetables just to get the calories. But I don't know anybody that's craving just fruits for the evening. So maybe if you have a really good quality fruits, but avocados didn't work for me. So post your comments and I'll see you soon.